get to higher ground. Oh no, you took it, didn't you? Hurry. They're on their way. Who? Dr. Dominguez and more men. Apparently we found what we're looking for. Great. Then the siege begins. Yeah, that's what the reinforcements are for. What's going on guys? Welcome back to some more of Shadow of the Tomb Raider. As you can see man, we're picking up right where we left off. About to bust out this wall and see what kind of chaos we unleashed on the world. Just pure savage. I love how she just blends How's in. Look at that. My guy's resting. Answer me. You finished with that pump yet? Yeah, let me get out of here before these guys come down here. This isn't time for games, shithead. Operation Blackout has been issued. None of the local workers leave the site alive. Shit, eh? These guys are pure savages. Fuck. We've planned for this. Make sure the perimeter's secure. Alright, so yellow enemies are isolated. Red enemies are visible to others. Okay, I get it. Ooh. Ooh. Jeez. Ah, uh, don't worry, I'll fix it. This is taking way too long. He just has to wait for us when he gets here. It's not gonna be pretty. Alright, I'll investigate. The specters are coming, be ready. Yo, this guy got laid out. Come here. Base camp, this is the Amelina. Where's our backup? Don't give me that shit. The site is secure, but we still need some cover. I'm sure somebody heard something. Second part of the plan. Tell the locals we shot a rabbit jungle cat and damn it, she's hunting us. Oh, oh shit. Base camp outpost. Didn't know it. Outpost, are you there? Yeah. Over. You, take point. Copy that on search. All right, come around here, one of you guys. Need to search there. Ooh. Jeez, oh crap. You have any idea? Oh shit, how did you shoot me through the wall, bro? Bro, I need a gun. Yo, holy crap! You see that, guys? Like this shit went straight through this man. All right, let me get that. 
I need an actual gun, bro. All right, I'm gonna have to be more careful. I wonder if there's a way you can hide the body. Oh damn. Shit, eh? They're moving in. Oh, I have a gun now. Oh. I didn't know this was gonna turn into GTA, but okay, I can rock with that. Need more ammo, eh? Oh, shit. Right in the nuts. Oh wow, what the hell? I didn't even know I had more weapons. What the hell? There, I held all this time. I can't believe all this time I had a gun. I had multiple guns. <laughs> okay. Somebody's getting hit with that shoddy, bro. That shoddy to the body. Let's go. Oh shit. Stop. Don't hurt her. Lara Croft. I don't want your help, bro. Get out of here. This isn't the way I hope with me. You know I've been interested in your work. Trinity always is. <laughs> the key of Sasha. You're a sad, sad man. It's in a safe place. You don't have it. It never occurred to me that you would just take it. With this key and the silver box, we can remake the world. Without witness, cruelty. 
And certainly with none of this. But without the box, the apocalypse, the death of the sun. You're lying. Lara, you felt it when you took the key. Tremors are common. A tsunami is coming, and this is the first of many catastrophes you're doing. You would have done the same. to me now, to stop it before it consumes us all. This is why you never take anything from an ancient temple. Wait, there's an actual tsunami coming? Holy shit. We're just getting washed away. Oh my goodness. Oh shit. Damn, these people's entire life getting destroyed. Damn, that guy just got bodied. Jeez. This is hectic. Ooh. Come on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Ooh. Come on. Hold on, hold on, there we go, come on, oh shit, oh shit, oh my goodness, don't drown, come on, please don't drown, okay, damn, all these people, dead, all because of a stupid dagger. <laughs> open, 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 open. Oh damn, we're trapped, eh? I try and get on top of one of these houses. Okay, can you get up here? Alright, we're good, we're good, we're blessed. Oh shit. Okay, we're not blessed. Oh my goodness, where are we going? Where are we going? Oh damn, this is hectic. Ooh! Okay. Ooh, okay. Move, 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 move. Oh, jeez. Yeah, this is hectic. Come on, come on, hurry up, hurry up. What the hell? Why is this kid outside? Oh my goodness, I can't believe you just killed this kid. 
Wow. Okay, we gotta hurry. We gotta hurry. This thing is falling apart. I lost it. After everything that my father went through, I gave Trinity exactly what they wanted. He'll use the box and the knife to remake the world. To remake it into what? I don't know. He thinks he can rid it of sin and weakness. A man like that, we... We have to stop him. It's all my fault. We'll figure it out, okay? I, I promise. No, 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 no! We have to get to the hidden city before Trinity. We have to find the silver box. Okay, but first... We're gonna help these people get to safety, and then we'll go after the box. No, no one is safe! Not if he gets the box first! I have to go! I'm the only one! You're the only one that can what? You don't know that you caused all this, Laura! Not everything is about you! These people need us here. We can do good now! Besides, what do we gotta go on? A riddle? We're gonna need more than pink fish and silver crowns to get to the hidden city. Yo, my guy's a G. I know you're in love with her, my guy, but she needs to know the truth. I'm gonna help these people. And then I'll find this plane. Yeah. My guy had to put her in check. You freaking destroy these people's lives and then you're just gonna leave to go hunt a pink fish. Jeez. Everything is just getting bodied. Yo, my guy's still mad. Can't blame you. An apology would be nice. I think we're looking for a volcanic mountain. The crown of silver is probably a band of clouds. I just can't get those people back there out of my head. They lost everything. The riddle says, chase the heart of the serpent to the Silver Crown Mountain where the twins confer. I wonder what the twins are. This girl's determined. This storm looks like bad news. It's just a little rain. We'll concentrate on the cloudy mountain. Cloudy Mountain. If we find it, how do we know we have the right one? Gut feeling? It's our only clue. The mural says there'll be more disasters. The best way we can help them is to put a stop to it and Trinity. Okay. But how do we really know? Jonah, what I felt when I took the dagger. You mean the tremors of the tsunami? More than that. It felt like I woke something up. Because you did. I know that it's not practical. I know that it's hard to believe. But you need to trust me. We have to trust each other. Hey, I might have something over here. Really? That's it! 
don't like this storm. Should we come back in the morning? We're so close. I guess a little turbulence wouldn't stop Trinity either. Miguel, is there anywhere to land? Yeah, I can put you down near Kuak Jaku. Let's go. Got laid out. I guess we're back to where we were at the beginning of the game. Once again, disaster befalls us. And who is to blame? Lara. I really hope Jonah didn't die, but I don't think they would have killed him off so early in the story. I swear this girl is so stubborn. She could have just turned back, came in the morning, everything would have been fine. But no, had to do it now. Dr. Pedro Dominguez is an archaeologist and expert in pre-colonial Maya history. My father mentioned him in his notes more than once. That's the lead Jonah and I were following up on when we came to Cozumel. His excavation in Cozumel was one of the last places my father visited before he was killed. If there is a connection, I want to find out what it is. I thought that Dr. Dominguez was only the leader of the local Trinity cell. I never imagined that he would turn out to be the leader of the High Council of Trinity. Interesting. Miguel! Hopefully, we don't get attacked by any of the animals because I don't think we have any weapons. Let me check. Yeah, I don't have any weapons. So. Could be useful. Yeah, I'll just collect everything I see along the way. Can we run? No, we can't run, eh? I'll keep this for later. Oh, hold up. Should we go here? here? Jonah! Can anyone hear me? Okay, now we can kind of run. That's good. Where are they? Probably dead. Have to find them. Yeah. Oh, nice! It's starting to clear up. It looks so, so much better. Mountain. I'm getting closer. Oh, nice! Somebody's over there. Someone's over there. I have to get to them. Alright, we're not going down that way because I don't think we have our axe to climb or anything. You gotta be careful we don't fall off though. Ooh. Alright, so let's see if we can jump. Ooh, that was so close. Okay. Can we take the eggs too? 
yo, wait, they expect me to make this jump. Okay, guys, be honest now. How unrealistic is this jump? There's no way I can make this jump without some kind of tool. I'm probably gonna die, <laughs> but let's see how it goes. Re Woo! Really, bro? Okay, don't fall off. Yo, that was so unrealistic. There's no way she should have been able to make that jump. Paulus. Hopefully these things don't attack me when I go up there. Wait, oh, I can't go up there? Oh, I have to go here. Careful, careful, careful. Steady as she goes. Ooh, steady as she goes. Oh, there's a feather here. I'll take that. Oh, careful, careful. Can you make that? This looks a little bit more realistic. What? Let's see. Ooh. Ugh. Okay. A fire. Someone must be around. Hello? Jonah. Miguel. Can you hear me? Where are you? Starting to think the smoke signal was set off by those howlers. What is this? The monogram reads P H F. That has to stand for Percival Harrison Fawcett. I have no idea who that is. This is the flight log from our plane. Miguel made notes about the long-term weather forecast. Warm, hot, and dry for the next three days. Highs in the low 30s, mostly clear skies with nothing but light rain expected. Based on his other entries, if Miguel had thought the chances of a severe storm were better than half, he wouldn't have flown us at all. But there was no storm predicted, let alone something serious. Alright, so that's just to build the story to let us know that we caused it, like we didn't already know that. I didn't know the storm would hit so hard. This is all my fault. I should have listened to Jonah, thought it through. I never should have taken that dagger. I hope no one else was hurt, no other village destroyed. Hmm. I need to stop these cataclysms before it's too late. All right, so this is the skill menu. Hmm. All right, so let's see. Let's get some of the warrior skills. I'll get I'll get this one. All right. And I'll get this one too. All right. Now, let us see. Part of the plane landed here. My, my gear is in that cargo. I need to cut it down. Can we won't be able to open that without a tool. Oh, we literally have nothing, eh? Well, maybe a piece of scrap from the wreck. Ooh. Ooh. Oh wow. It just... Ah, great. It fell in the water. I guess we're going down there after it. Come on. Get it. Get it. Really? Of all the things to attack me, and of all the times to do it. Wait, what the hell? Okay. Get off me. Yo, how unrealistic was that, guys? Like, she literally just pulled a perfectly shaped knife out of a piece of the plate. Like, that made no sense. Let's 
Is there anything else down here? Nah. Alright, let's get out of here before I drown. Alright, let's go cut down my gear. Let's get that. Oh crap, did you see shot? Okay. Good, but it's dull. I need to find something to sharpen it. Hopefully these things don't attack me because I'd really rather not have to kill any animals. Alright, so we gotta find stuff to use to sharpen this thing. Can we open this now? I can use this. Still need more though. Oh, okay. Hmm. Let's go up here. Oh, there's one here. Okay, cool. Exactly what I was looking for. Just need a bit more. Wait, she said exactly what I was Oh, there we go. Two, okay. Oh, wait, can I climb this? Oh, no, I don't have my tools. Duh. Oh, there's one here. Nice. Got everything I need. Should head back to camp. Alright, so that's the hide of a dead animal. We can use that to restore outfits and craft weapon upgrades. Alright, let's go back to the camp. No, we can't go through here. Okay. Ooh, ooh, chill, chill. Okay, I thought that was gonna attack me for a second there. Alright, so you have to craft a makeshift knife. Alright, so we're nice and sharp. That should be sharp enough. Alright, so another knife all sharpened up. Let's see if we can go get our stuff. Ooh! Something's still holding the supplies up. Ah, oh, there's a second rope tethering them. Nice. Now I can get my gear back. <sighs> all that for my bowl. Why didn't I pack all my equipment together? Well, it's better than nothing. Miss Croft? Anyone? Come in! Miguel? Where are you? Damn! Wait, that Miguel guy is actually still alive? After he got laid up by that piece of ice, I thought he would have been dead. Wait, there's no way we can make this jump. This is way too unrealistic. Hold up. Oh, uh, I see what we have to do. Right here. So this is why we needed our bow. Okay. Let me see, do I have my guns and stuff? Nah, I don't. Okay. Miguel? I don't like this. Miguel? Yeah. Where are you? Oh no. Pretty sure Miguel's dead. <sighs> Miguel? Miguel? Yeah, this guy's boots are here.
What is this? Every part of the world seems to have its own mythical, forest-dwelling, bipedal creature. Around here, it's known as the Sisamite, the guardian of the forest. Described as large and ape-like, it's rumored to kill male humans on sight, but takes the females to its cave for mating purposes. Oh shit, eh? Hopefully we don't get attacked by that. Well, I guess we wouldn't have to worry about him killing Laura, but I don't think I would like to see what he's gonna do to her. Miguel. Oh, can I? Can I even make that fall? Oh, okay. Yeah, Miguel is dead. Something loses that much blood, no way they're alive. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Please don't tell me I have to fight this. Please don't tell me I have to fight this Jaguar. I would really rather not. Yo, he's so cute too. Oh my goodness. I hope I can like tame him and keep him as a pet. Oh shit, there's two. Why am I so surprised? This cats always live in packs. Oh my goodness. Okay. I guess we're really gonna have to fight these things. My words exactly. No, 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 oh God. Got to be careful here. I'm pretty sure they're just going to jump me out of nowhere. Go through here, yeah. Damn it. I gotta be real careful. Oh, crap. Ooh. I really don't want to have to kill these guys. Where did he go? Ooh! Oh crap, eh? Okay, I see what they're doing. They're taking turns and going with me. Shit. Okay, I gotta be faster, eh? So sad, I really don't like having to kill animals. I would much rather have to kill someone. Because these things are just trying to live their life, you know? They're just hungry. Oh my goodness, get off me. Get off me, get off me, get off me, get off me. No, 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 no. Oh my goodness, no. That is so sad, guys. That is just so sad. I would have really rather just keep him. Oh my goodness, no. We are so dead. Really? He let us live? Wow. 
Wow. Animals can be so forgiving. Oh my goodness. I thought we were straight dead. He just picked up his mate and just left. Shit, eh? Wow, boys. That's kind of sad, to be honest with you guys. Alright, boys. So, we're going to wrap this thing up right here. And I'll pick it up with you guys <laughs> in the next one. This one's been a little bit on the longer side. Really kind of sad that we had to kill that Jaguar. I would love to keep it as a pet. Take it with me. 